KFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 2 p.m. Eastern time on Thursday, two hours left to go in the trading day. And we got a volatile market in both directions. Right now, the S&P is negative by just four points, trading at 3,043, up there right near session highs, rebounding from the lows we had this morning. And the S&P futures, you're talking about 32 points above where we were trading at as of 9.45 a.m. this morning. You zoom in on things on the trading day, highs of the session at about 3,051, made about an hour and a half ago. NQs negative by just two points. Check out this volatility. NASDAQ on the open. NQs, that is, down at 98.85. We're up more than about 110 points from that level, back above 10,000. 10,010. Dow down just 52 points. We're 300 points off the lows, basically, that we had this morning. Low of 25,073. Call it 270 points above that price level, 25,340. Oil up 73 cents. Check out that rebound as well. Oil a solid $1.75 above where we were at as of 8.30 a.m. this morning when we got the weekly jobless claims number. We'll jump over to that in a moment. 1.5 million weekly jobless claims. That's initial claims, too, for the week. Gold, gold right now down three dollars at seventeen seventy one, and silver up twenty one cents at seventeen eighty eight. Notes and bonds, we're getting some higher price and lower yield. The ten year up one tick at one thirty eight twenty nine. The thirty year up eleven ticks at one seventy eight oh seven. We'll start things off. We'll start it off with a chart. Uh, excuse me. We'll start it off with those weekly jobless claims. 1.48 million. That number hitting the tape at eight thirty a.m. this morning. Continuing claims down 767,000, but still at about 19.5 million. And if you look at it, folks, the last three weeks, that's a plateau of 1.5 million jobs just for the last three weeks going on average. Is that the new normal that every week we have a, a variety of different jobs now just going to where they're uh, filing for initial jobless claims, scary number. And then you look at where we are in terms of continuing claims, quite an escalation. We really need to see that number far from where we're at right now before we're anywhere near back to pre-COVID levels. And those numbers, 45,000. I just checked on Florida, the recent number. 5,028, the number that made a lot of press the day before, 5,400. Total cases, 114,000 now in the state of Florida. Other news out there, how about those bank stocks trading higher as they're going to get to ease that Volcker rule. Stay tuned, folks. Should be an interesting two hours left to go in the trading day. Dave White live at two. Tom O'Brien live at three. Stay tuned. We'll be right back.